Hello and welcome to my 100% playthrough of D Zone Gold. This is 4octa.wad and it will be played through GZ Doom. Alright, so we can immediately see how this ward got its name. 4 octa, meaning 4 octagons. Yeah, and you can immediately see the exit, but we're not going to take it for a while. First we're going to grab some weapons and we get the BFG immediately, but and there are some keens, but we'll leave them for a while because there are enemies that we don't want to wake up. So yeah, we'll just collect the weapons here. Get some more ammo. Now we pull out the BFG and just kill all these guys. And the master might survive, that's rare. I'm just going to gun her down with a chain gun. It doesn't really matter. So now the imminent threat is dealt with, so there's the keens. So we're just going to kill all of them and see what happens when when we do so. It's one keen, two keens, three keens, four keens, five keens, six keens, seven keens, and the last eighth keen. Nothing happens. Yeah, no secrets. All the enemies, so we can exit. So yeah, that was that's that that's the entire map. That's for Octa, and I think this is actually the best map we've had so far because it's a genuine art piece. Uh, firstly, there there are the keens, which uh, you know when when you see them, you expect something to happen when you kill all of them, just like in Map Thirty One of Doom Two or. Uh, map 30, no, map 32 of Doom 2, sorry, or map 31 of uh, Hellbound, or uh, map 29 of Plutonia 2. When you kill all the kings in Doom, you expect something to raise up, but this map brilliantly subverts your expectation by uh, absolutely nothing happening when the kings die. Uh, secondly, there are there's the enemy placement. Uh, you may have heard at the start that the uh, Spider Mastermind hears you immediately but she's being held in place by the weakest enemy in the game. The final boss of the original game is, can't do anything to the player because of the weakest zombie men, and I think that actually says a lot about society. And thirdly, there's uh, the shape of the entire room, which uh, you may have noticed it's it's for octagons, but you could also take it that it's the uh, shape of the logo of Audi, the uh, German uh, car manufacturing company. And uh, what I think it's meant to uh, mean is that it's an ironic, uh, ironic product placement in in an art piece, which I think is supposed to symbolize the financial struggle of many artists when they try to do what they were destined to do, what they have talent for, and uh, that is uh, creating art. And, you know, uh, a lot of people might say that this map was probably created by someone who was born in the 80s, which means that uh, by the time this map came out, he, uh, he or she was a child, but but I, I think that actually makes this map a lot better, that it was made by, by, by someone so young, a, a prodigy of art. So, yeah, I think... I think this map won't be uh, surpassed for a very long time, but I hope I'll still see you in the next one.